Welcome. Welcome to another review. Got a bottle open here. That means I'm going to need it to open a bottle. Now I'm going to try not to touch the table too much because in the last review for the Palma Violet beer, I noticed the camera was shaking because I was touching the table a lot. Anyway, today I've gone for a local brewery in Nottingham, which is the Lincoln Green Brewing Co. Where I actually went down to the brewery and bought a load of stuff from their shop. And today I'm trying Old Bailey. This is an Irish cream. I do not like the lighting in here. Let's turn the camera a bit. This is an. Oh, there we go. This is an Irish cream ale, pale ale. It's only 3.8, but I'm looking forward to see what it tastes like because I'm a big fan of Bailey's and also I like what they've done with the name Old Bailey, kind of um, not doing copyright breach, but kind of getting to the point still. But Lincoln Green, I would recommend. I've got a few beers in the pipeline to review from them, but we're going to give this well, or I'm going to give it a well. See if I like it, see if it tastes like Irish cream, especially after a couple of beers I've done lately. I've done the Imperial Stout, which really tastes like banana, and a little bit, a bit like chocolate. Stout kind of tastes like chocolate anyway, but it really tastes like banana, if you remember. <laughs> it's a very strong liqueur, more of a liqueur, really. And then I've had the Palmer Violets beer, so it's interesting to get something that's also flavoured and based on a spirit again. And I'm sorry about that streak of light from the window. I will sort that out next time. Just like I'm trying to sort out the shake. I'm going to give this a whirl. I'm going to open it with this Las Vegas bottle opener that I got from Lee Cogsworth. And because uh, I've, I've only actually got uh, two fans, I know that table shook again. Two fans for this show Luke Cogsworth and Joe Marshall. Joe Marshall, I'm just trying to make it sound posh. The Sam Smith's glass again. Do you reckon if I plug that enough, they'll send me some beer to review? Because. Um, that would be really cool, but a lot of that stuff was pretty samey when I used to drink it back in the day. No offence. You know what we say at this point? While I'm waiting for the head to go down, go look at this. I like all the imagery and stuff. This brewery does a lot of Robin Hood themed beers. They do Hood, Marion, Tuck, uh, Sheriff. And they're not actually, and I can't remember if I kept that in the review or not. When we went to Nottingham Castle, they had Blue Monkey Brewery, which is very local to me. And I've got nothing against them. I really want to try their Blue Barb and Custard beer eventually. But I thought it was weird they didn't have the Robin Hood beers at Nottingham Castle in the gift shop. So anyway, that looks quite cool. That's not very pale, considering what I've had lately. Like the IPAs and things. That's not as pale as it's been. And it's quite a white head in it. It smells like Irish cream. That's a good sign. It smells really sweet, actually. Very creamy. Oh, that's good. That 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 is Bailey's. That is Bailey's in a beer. Can't can't say simpler than that. That is Bailey's in a beer. It's not overpowering. It's certainly not Imperial Stout overpowering. It's about on level with Palmer Violet, where it wasn't too overpowering, but it was there. So I'm being cautious with the table so it doesn't shake. But yeah, that das ist good, as the Germans would say. Lincoln Green Brewery. I've got a lot of beers lined up, and I've, I'm really looking forward to it. But that is a precursor for what's to come, then I'm really looking forward to trying them. The only thing about that that's a bit weird, and not necessarily bad, is I can't believe that's only 3.8%, because it tastes like Irish cream mixed in, well, in a beer. The texture is beer, the texture is not Irish cream, but the taste is Irish cream. I like the design of the bottle, I'm looking at the bottle now, I'll put the bottle there for what you can see of it. Damn light there. But you got like uh, leaves and stuff, you can enjoy that. That's really nice. If you like Baileys, yeah. If you like Baileys, try the old Bailey. 
and uh, if anyone from Lincoln Green is watching, I love your brewery. I'm going to review more of your beers. And uh, yeah, that's a good solid beer. Um, I'm not doing it justice there. There's better than it. It depends if you like Irish cream. If you like Irish cream, or if you like something different in your beer, that is at least a 7 or 8 out of 10. I don't like giving it a rating out of 10. And there's only 10 things to judge things by and when you get to judging like 50 100 things there's a 7 out of 10 that's not quite as good as another 7 out I don't like writing it 7 out of 10 but it's good beer good beer not too strong if you want to have a few but yeah if you're in the area or if you want to order on you can order online go to Lincoln Green search them on Google or go to the brewery shop which is a lovely shop I think I ended up buying a beanie hat there as well so i got a good mix of ears but that is really good but then i like I, <laughs> I used to drink irish cream by the pint so drinking that is going to be a lot less uh, consequential to me isn't it i'm drinking a pint of baileys that's really good i'd recommend at least trying that unless you really don't like baileys so yeah Lincoln green brewery good drink um, I'll see you next time. Obviously, comment below what you want me to try next, and I'll try and get. I will try and reply to all comments anyway. Um, keep watching the channel. We've also got uh, travel vlogs, and like the video, subscribe, pass it on, tell other people, especially if they like good beer, like good chat. I like getting comments in below where we talk about the beers, talk about beers you've tried, what you think of them, what you think about the beers that I've tried, like this one, and also just talking about getting back out in the pubs again, and. This is a solid entry if you want to get a load of beers in. I, I don't think many people would dislike this, unless you really don't like Baileys. So that is, if you can see on that lighting there, Old Bailey from Lincoln Green gets a thumbs up from me. And that's all you really need. You don't need a thing out of 10. You just need a thumbs up or not. So yeah, cheers. <laughs>